This monumental event not only transformed the landscape of Russia, but also sent ripples across the world, igniting the flames of hope and empowerment for workers everywhere. As we commemorate this historic moment, we must remember the words of Vladimir Lenin. I quote, the working class must be the master of its own destiny, close quote. This quote resonates deeply within our context today. It underscores the necessity for workers to seize the control for their futures, to stand united in the face of adversity, and to advocate for, the rights, for their rights. The coming International Day on Decent Work originates from the International Labour Organization, reporting to each 87th session of the ILO conference in 1999, which indicated that, I quote, the primary goal of the ILO today is to promote opportunities for women and men to obtain decent and productive work in conditions for freedom, equality, security, and human dignity. This assertion led to the concept of decent work lodged in 1999. Chairperson, the International Day for Decent Work comes at a time when South Africa is faced with a very high official unemployment rate of 33.9%, which is now having an extended rate of 42 or 42.6%. And this unemployment rate is hitting women, youth, and Africans than any gender, race, and age. Thus, we call upon workers in this province to join the ANC-led government in a deliberate effort to contribute in the struggle for decent work by filling all vacant positions and creating a conducive environment in which we can create more work opportunities. We call all workers across federations to join hands in the fight for living wage and better wage increase, especially during these seasons of wage negotiations.